I have here the seven program loaded with the equation y equals in brackets the square root of x over x minus 2 all to the power 4. This is the text mode of the application. I'm going to issue the look command now and it will tell me about the current line segment as well as the y which is currently in focus. Greater look, you are currently viewing the document. The current line is colon. Y equals the current focus is colon. Y location colon. 9. 55 from this element. The following elements can be reached colon. Right colon. Equals use. Okay, I stopped the speech there in the interest of time, but it told us that we are currently focused on the Y, and to the right of us is the equals. I can move to the equals by typing the right command. Greater right moved right equals location colon. Tw That's the equals. I can play it with the play command. Greater. That's the sound of the equals. Let me switch to a graphical mode where I can actually interactively use the cursor keys to explore the e equation. Switch. And you will see that it shares the focus with the text mode. So we are still on the equals. So let me move to the Y. Uh, that's just, I just switched to uh, pro, uh, focus mode with the screen reader there. Y. So that's the Y. It played as the Y and it also announced the Y. Equals. That's the equals. And that sound is the bracket. I can actually play it again um, by issuing the command to play the element right of the equals. So that's the bracket. Let us move to the square root. Raised. It told us that uh, it played a bunch of stuff and it told us that the square root is raised, so it's higher than the equals. I can also move down to the denominator of the fraction and it will play the fraction line as I move over it. X. Yes, it played as the X and it also played the fraction line. Now, finally, I quickly want to show the touch gestures. Text self voicing button. Self voicing enabled. So it's also in self-voicing mode, just because it's difficult for screen readers to operate in, sc in full screen mode. So now if I move my finger across the screen, it should play the elements. No text. That's the Y. And the equals. And that's the bracket. And I can also use two fingers to move, for instance, from top to bottom over the bracket. And that's the end of this little demonstration. I hope you found it interesting.